What's up, gamers? Welcome to the Freak Review. First match, let's get it underway. Um, it should be a good one. This is a story match, and it's building off of last week, and it's gonna be a good one. There seems to be a situation. Oh, there seems to be a commotion in the nice. back. Oh I said, this God. looks like more than just a situation. This is an all out brawl. Oh my God. They this were not, not happy with the tag team well. results. Bang. Yes. So now, so, folks. Uh, this is how this is gonna work. The winner oh, of this man, backstage man. brawl gets to do the, the stipulation for next week when we do Becky Lynch versus Liv Morgan. Ah. Oh my God. And Liv has a solid steel chair. Oh, this is oh my not good God. for the man. She's able to get out of the way. They have one of right but she gets up place. and she's tough like that. In a no disqualification match, different. you never want to be the superstar on the wrong end of a chair or a kendo stick. <laughs> Or whatever else might be hiding under the ring. You want to be the oh. one inflicting oh. that punishment. If Liv wins, the match stipulation will be extreme rules. Oh God, if Becky wins, there. what would you want her stipulation to be? Um, and that was a successful bit of offense. Your superstar. Oh, an exploder suplex. Submission match? No. Ooh. I'm, my brain's going submission match. Because Liv's never been in a submission match. Hooking it up Is here. There's... What's next? Oh, Boom. Um, incredible suplex. Let's see. She gets Face extreme Buster. Rules. And Becky will get. Uh... Yeah, it would be a perfect match. Oh. Alright, so that's our stipulations. If Liv wins, this will be extreme rules. If Becky wins somehow. It, it's like if That'll Liv wins, she gets the job. advantage. If Becky wins, Becky gets the advantage. By the way, whoever made this call, good job. It looks just like Becky. Yes. yes, it does. I definitely appreciate it. Oh, what a neck breaker. Turning it around into a butterfly suplex. Oh. Is, like, the lunch room. All right, right now, Liv has the advantage. Well, no, actually, Becky does. Oh, Jesus Christ, poor Liv. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, my God. Come on, Liv, fight back. You got this. There you go. I think mean, this is Liv's first backstage brawl. And another no, counter! Becky is not going to take it. <laughs> oh, look at this. Oh, How my God. Oh, this? no. Oh, backpack oh, check out that shit. Oh, wow. Perfect. Oh, oh her legs. Oh, man. No. Oh, man. She oh. whiffed! Oh, what was that? that? I don't know. She <laughs> missed, and then not she backing down. Down. <laughs> Not now. Not now. Oh, she smacked her. What's going on in the background? That's going crazy. Second one. Yeah, the insecurity. Effective. Oh, she's going for the table. That did not work. Oh. Uh oh. Bulldog. Oh. Bulldog from Liv Morgan. Guillotine apply. Guillotine apply. He has the guillotine. <laughs> What? This what is this, Liv? Why is she moving the moves over her ass? <laughs> Fighting desperately. Maybe she would have the advantage. She's able to shrug off her opponent. If she could pull off the freaking guillotine. She just dodged! She got it. There. Liv is not an opponent to get Oh, look at this. Hair pulled match slam. This could go either way. I love I made this match. And now she's got a chair. Oh, she has the advantage now. She oh, did. She's dodging him, though. Hey, well, She's facing through the chair Come shots. Oh. And then the arm oh, rolls with no. oh, oh, But this won't win the match. It has to be knockout. Who she pass oh, out? Arm is trapped, but she gets away. No, has a chance. Did you hear that impact? Oh, the face oh. first. Oh, why on the fucking. That's a few Boy, times now she's taken a hit up in that region. Oh, she is just throwing her around. Oh my god. Oh, what are you doing? Well, she Slim saw has an idea. She saw something. Yes, I saw the cogs turning. What is this? She's shovel. got a shovel again. Shovel. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, no. She's just teasing oh she's angry. She's fucking pit. Oh, find her. No. no. Don't hit her there. Oh, man. Jesus. She's gonna fly off her hands again. Nope, not this time. Nope. She was clearly waiting for Oh shit. Liv, are you good? No. That didn't sound good at all. <laughs> Holy oh! shit! The Double fucking slow. counter kick! <laughs> shit! <laughs> ST! 
STO onto the chair. Onto the chair. STO onto the chair. That should have been it. With the oh. stomp. <laughs> Becky's tough though. She took, she tanked a punch from Nia Jax. She can fucking take it. Oh my gosh, what impact! Any of these hits can end it. A good oh, hit with impact. like a chair. She's done. Shit. Morgan and the WWE Universe exchange she's like appreciation. <laughs> she's definitely the chairs on top of each other. Oh dear God. She's got another she's chair. She's got another one. And that one misses the mark. Uh oh. Oh. We're gonna see it. Oh. Sit down, power bomb. As their opponent. Oh, oh no. Oh, that slam. didn't end it. That did not end it. That didn't end it. Look at this leg drops not finished yet. Oh, stay down. she ended it with Looks a like elbow to second. the face. This brawl is over. Oh <laughs> shit! I don't... Let's make this a best two out of three match. Let's make this more interesting. Let's make it best two out of three. <laughs> yeah, yes. I want to make it more interesting. That was to make up for that dog shit tag team. To this, we're gonna make this up to you, Liv and Becky, because you guys deserve a good match. Yeah, two out. Of... I'm I'm comfortable with two out of three. <laughs> yes. I am very comfortable with two out three. He won. Live zero. See the walls come yes. Down so here. live these two wins in a row to win. I don't like the looks of this. Becky immediately going really in for the counter. The backstage area is no place to settle your differences. Peter right in the head. You guys deserve better after that dog shit match oh, last week. Yeah. They're probably not going to move around as much because they're just going to beat the dog shit out of each other. Bam! But that's okay. At least live went for a shovel. And she did a flying kick I'd never seen her do before. That was crazy. Oh, yeah, like a fucking headlock. Side headlock takeover. Tremendous pressure on the head and neck. So if Becky wins, it's over, right? Yeah. Northern Lights. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. So Liv needs to be the miracle kid here, and she needs to win twice in a row. Yes, yeah, she needs to win twice in a row. Given the no disqualification modifier on this match, Corey, what kind of tactics should you expect to see here? Ruthless tactics, Cole. Now is the time for these superstars to unleash their pent up aggression and be as violent as they want. There's nothing the ref can do about it, so they should go all out. Bullseye with the drop kick. All right, Liv has ideas. All right, she's she's got the chair again. For that chair in particular. <laughs> and knocking down that chair for later. That was smart. Oh. <laughs> then he went for the jumping attack. And she jumps. Oh, and then she eats Second a kick. Yeah, as part of the any insecurity. Liv says no. <laughs> I, okay. She wants that chair oh, back. Yeah. Okay, guys. <laughs> Oh, uh, do so in the windup. Oh, and she counters. Joy, she jumps in her chest. And a kick. Morgan's starting to think she might have uh, this one in the back. I just was there. <laughs> Face into, the into the chair. Yeah, I heard that. <laughs> oh, God. Uh oh. Oh! 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 This is better than the first match. Oh god. Facebreaker! Face breaker! Facebreaker! <laughs> oh, she's Liv has gone unhinged. She's completely stunned. If she hits her good, then she will end this. Oh my! She steers clear of that one. Oh, and they're fighting over the chair. Oh, the chair has been discarded. Suplex! What is with live matches? And every match is unique. Oh, Something new always happens. Something always happens. Letting her live is failing her knee. She is ready for anything. Oh no. Us. Rolling through. Oh, they got got the arm, got the arm. Disarmor, disarmor. Well, this isn't gonna win the fall, but it's gonna do a lot of damage. I think that was like a new armbar like Slides transition. Slides right out of the disarmor. Ooh. Oh shit. Liv's confused. She's got a chair. Liv has five chairs. She doesn't know which one to use. Oh, and oh, she dodged it. Some time. 
Nope. Well time. Sweet ships the valley. Becky is slowy. Oh! 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 It's like this brawl's over now. I was saying now she was taking it back, and then she got face breaker. Okay. Next one wins. Next one wins. Whoever wins this takes the stipulation for Becky Lynch versus Liv next week. I think I think her going through the table is what kind of decided that match. <laughs> She was like, What's going on here? Break it. Oh, 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 oh the dog! Oh, the great bucket! Oh my god, there they go! Oh. Look at this Northern Light suplex! Uh oh, carefully measured. Go! Oh, Becky, that is Lincoln. wrong! No, that is so that, wrong! That is mean. That was mean. <laughs> Jarring impact. <laughs> it's a box is like it's an angry video game nerd video. Boy, you're a pin uppercut. Live is countering. What a counter. And it seems like you have to be at least a little sadistic to be victorious in an ODQ match. Live oh, is the sadistic one on this one. It's here. about being <laughs> smart. There's no safety net and no disqualification this match, and that's a big oh. factor in succeeding. There's nothing sadistic about it. He's oh, going oh, neck and neck. Oh, head oh, damage man, to hair, Becky. Yep. Hair whip. Oh, God! Oh, oh, stunning Becky with the roundhouse kick. He's going for the legs. Jacket. Elbow drop to the knee. A uh, jumping stop oh, to the God. gut. Liv's not playing around. Liv is not playing around in the final round. Hey. Oh, Becky's Big taking it back. Forearm. Big forearm smash. He's just knocking her into the ground. Oh, she's going for something. I don't know what her <laughs> plan was there. She is... <laughs> the head damage did a lot more than expected. Oh, here, here. <laughs> this is what I want, yes! Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> when did she get, like, new armbar stuff? She was knocking to the ground, and now Liv got out of the armbar! Liv got out of the armbar! Oh my god! She turned back in! It's gotta be over! Oh my god! Arm is trapped, but she gets away! Oh! Oh! She's got Batty! She got, she got Batty! <laughs> oh! She got that way out of her hand just in time. Oh, the knees. One after the other. And good thing all that oh, equipment is dirty. Take it back, it's over. Solid chance. Someone's getting thrown into it. Oh, oh she did! Wait, what are you saying? She's gonna take it back! <laughs> she might do it. No! Oh! oh. The dentist. And as off limits as this area may be, they are clearly making themselves at home here. I don't know what it's like at your home, oh. Cole, but they're definitely acting like on the place. Oh, oh, oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> She's got Patty again! The band's back! Oh no! Taking this fight out of that equipment pile. A lot of that equipment oh, god. looks like it'll hurt. Oh, Liv's got this. Oh, Liv's got this. Oh, is she gonna get stuff from this? Oh, no! <laughs> One more hit and she would've been stunned. Oh, oh, she missed! No! Oh, shit! Uh oh! Double leg drop! Extremely dangerous situation here. This loading dock is full of metal edges and hard surfaces. One false move and you could easily get she injured. She almost knocked her out with that punch. Oh, Able oh to she is not taking that there. shit. Oh, man, this. By the oh, Liv. Oh, fuck. Into the box. Road cases are not very now she's got kendo. They're definitely not made That's a kendo stick. Boom. Oh. Boom. Oh, she's Boom. done. She's like the over. That's oh, a few times now she's taking a hit up in that region. <laughs> oh, this doesn't look stable enough to be fighting oh, on. What is Liv have? Bat. She wants to end it. No, she doesn't. <laughs> Wait, what? She wants a hockey stick? Is that a hockey stick? What is that? Uh, <laughs> I don't I don't understand. 
<laughs> oh. Oh. production boxes and shipping crates willing to fight oh, she fell off. everywhere. Oh my god. Seriously hurt. Oh my god. <laughs> she just pulled the miracle kid and won twice in a row. Oh my god. <laughs> she made up for last week. <laughs> well, I would be salty that like Becky lost, but like that made up for the tag team match like twice over. Holy shit. They even ended it in like in the middle of like a box ring. <laughs> like <laughs> this was pretty much everything I wanted. They're not gonna do a unique shit where they like throw her into the spotlight. But uh, I'll take it. I will take it. I accept this. This was a great kickoff match. Yes. Holy this was, shit. This was their first match. And Liv won twice in a row. She was not having that after yeah. that. She took it back. She took it back. Like. She just didn't want. After losing once to Becky, she's like, "I'm not losing twice to Becky." It's like, nah, I'm losing. No way. <laughs> threw her through a table. She did everything that signature lift does. She threw her through a table. She used a kendo stick. She used Batty. The shovel was weird, but okay. Yeah, it worked. <laughs> but it worked. It's she. She put Becky through a table and then did like a face breaker. Yeah, and that's how so that helped her win that match. Yeah, and then and then she did a roundhouse kick that blew your mind yeah. in the first match. <laughs> Liv keeps blowing our mind every time we book her. Oh my god! <laughs> oh god! Please be better in like five months, please. <laughs> oh my god! The amount of shit you started doing the video game. Oh my god! <laughs> There's even moves you'd never see her do before, <laughs> and you were just like. <laughs> She did the guillotine. Oh, that was another moment that blew your mind. She did the Roman Reigns guillotine. She got the guillotine. Oh, my God. She might have a chance in the submission match after all. But it's too bad for you that Liv won the best two of three, and it will be hey, an extreme I'm, I'm taking the first match. I want a two out of three. I'm like, I want a two out of three match. Just because you want, you want it to be good. You want it yeah, to be good for I'll, the I'll after that it. dog shit tag match. And hey. It was good. Quite, yeah. It, it paid off. <laughs> I wanted, like, we did, like, three rematches in, like, last week. They all sucked. So, it's like, we need to do three matches. Best of three. And we had the stipulation rules. So, it's like, yeah, two out of three. Let's make it interesting. Two out of three. And she got two out of three. Congratulations. Holy oh, shit. <laughs> Man. Oh, okay. Now you got some content. Now we got contact. We can continue the storyline next week. It's going to be Becky Lynch versus Liv. Yep. Stream rules. I feel like that's a better match than a submission match anyways. Oh, yeah. It's like, all right, who has the advantage? It's like Liv gets the advantage because she's the one known to use all the weapons and shit. And Becky would get the advantage because she's the submission person. Correct. Oh, my God. How are we going to top that match? I don't know. <laughs> I should have made that the main event. I didn't know it would be that good. <laughs> I, typically, you don't have Bakshi Sprawl in the main event. That doesn't make sense. Yeah, no. <laughs> It appears our main event is canceled, and then the backstage brawl happens. That then that's officially the main event. Not unofficially the main event. Oh, well, we're still perfect. I booked it for Liv to win, anyways. Oh, nice. <laughs> so no, we're still course, perfect. Of course, we're supposed to win. I'd be starting to get Becky. Hey, at least she still gets her match. She gets she, her match. Yes, she does. Yes. And you will be against me next week because you will probably train for Becky, and I'll be training for Liv. Oh. That sucks. That wasn't ready. The king of strong style has arrived. Uh, gotta get ready. We're about to see the brutal striking ability of Shinsuke Nakamura on display. Shin is a true international superstar. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Kyoto, Japan. Weighing in at 220 pounds, Shinsuke Nakamura. You can feel the electricity in here, gentlemen. Just the infectious energy. 
will be his opponent. Tommaso Ciampa has revealed himself to be one of the most cutthroat and conniving superstars we've ever seen. Oh, you got this guy right. would stab you in the back just as soon as he'd shake your hand. Look, this business is no place for friendships and networking. It's a place for fighting and winning. No one knows that better than Tommaso. Well, we're going to see how that attitude serves Ciampa here. As I'm sure he's not here to make friends. Don't let his competition just lay back swag fool you. We call Nakamura the king of strong style for a reason. Shinsuke packs some of the hardest and most impactful hits that the WWE has ever seen. Listen, when he comes to pure striking ability, Nakamura has to crack the top ten all time. Maybe even higher. And he's not shy about putting that power to good use. Whatever it takes to secure the win and bring a little more glory to the reign of the king of strong style. Oh my, down with authority. Ah, uh, that bear take down. Big knee. Well scouted by Champa. Sit crashing to the floor. He leaves the ring, but he could lose this match by count out. By the way, next week, just to hype you up more, that will be the first time we're both Becky Lynch first live. I don't know. It's definitely something different. And a better slap, because Becky Lynch first live in real life was a great match. Champa gets countered there. Nakamura not shaken one bit by the presence of his opponent. That's because Becky had no other choice. This arena can't contain them, and if history's any indication, nothing good's about to happen up there either. Getting back into the ring. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Straight impact on the throat. He's going a little off balance. Yeah, just he looks frustrated. With the punch. I think you could call Tommaso Ciampa one of the grittier competitors here in WWE. How does that play? Baseball slide guy. Oh, he's gritty, all right. Ciampa's as tough as they come, and it makes. It... Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. If they stay out here and get DQ'd, I'm gonna be pissed. Double DQ, oh, the match the ends. Facing off at the top of the ring. I don't know what's gonna happen, but it's gonna hurt. Oh, this is one doesn't get to the second row. The opposition. Bring him back in the ring. That's it. Oh, and wait. I think we all know nothing good comes of fighting on the stage. Case in point, nothing good happening right now. Sound the alarm. Airway siren. I don't know how you survive that. And he gets set back into the ring. Champa has flight in mind. From way up. Oh! oh. <laughs> Wrenches the arm. Ooh, nasty kick. What a shot on the top of the board. Here we see a Kinshasa. He's out of there in a hurry. Champa is in a hurry, and he is letting the crowd know it. <laughs> Delivered into the barricade. This will win the match. Successfully does. 
Oh, oh. whoops! <laughs> I don't think she's gonna to do that. Maybe just stay down, man. You've done enough. Sit down, Corey Buster. Big risk here. He may be counted out. He might be oblivious to the count, guys. And he goes into the ring. And set right into the corner. Hey, he jumped out of the way. Oh. How did he get out from that? He popped his empty there. Yes, Shinsuke has three finishers stacked up. <laughs> <laughs> I know he has voice lines. He does. Kinshasa! Alright, time for Tom to try to sing the theme. <laughs> Here is your winner. <laughs> Because I know she's been doing that when you were in the room. When they went to We're still perfect! Two for two! <laughs> Here's a match that we that you will this is a send-off match to someone. But we're not going to cheer for them. Probably not, anyways. And it's going to be a false count anywhere, Matt. Oops. A battle hardened veteran and one of WWE's toughest women. The following contest is a false count anywhere match. <laughs> Making her way to the ring from Paris Island, South Carolina, Lacey Evans. <laughs> Apparently, her comments was I, I actually now know what her comments was about autism. Her comment was it, it's because people are eating too much processed food to become autistic. I ate too much processed food. It's a baby. I gave you autism. She also yeah. thinks that mental health is fake, so... Oh, God. <laughs> so this is the send off to Lacey Evans, who has just been released by WWE. Thank fucking God. Yeah, the air contract's over. She might be going to AEW. <laughs> Maybe. It's like, my name's gonna be this. But no, I'm sorry. Where's her tank? She got rid of the tank? Uh, I'm sure this is like a person character. Yes. And that's why she went Yes. I'm yes, I have to, I wanted the updated version because she shaved her head. Balls count anywhere. Lacey Evans versus Shotzi. Oh my god, that looks good. Qualification match, anything goes. And knowing these superstars, they're probably going to <laughs> find the limits on that. <laughs> what was that? Up on the middle what? Row. <laughs> what? In the lower back. 
Now the superstar from the apron. <laughs> Knee lifts <laughs> over and over again. Uh, yeah, do not do that. A little peacocking from Lacey Evans, but not sure how that helps her win the match. <laughs> Did you just smack Chelsea's oh, ass in the I don't know. <laughs> oh, shot. He's not doing this. From the top. Good. Oh, oh, wow. Taken flight. Taken out from I thought she was going to miss. You got to be some special kind of crazy to do that. She did like a drop kick. And the floor oh. smash. I believe the footage of this match is actually better than the first. I will not show that first. Because oh, Chelsea's our ass match. Oh, stop. Oh, stop. <laughs> Under the ropes. This is supposed to be a set off to Lacey. She's supposed to lose. We hate her. She's taking things to ringside. She's getting oh. some under the ring. Finally got a weapon. And of course, kendo sticks are always under the ring in the event of any rogue ninja attacks. Yeah, like Corey, what are the perils of this match that super What do they say in here? Uh, kendo sticks are here in case of ninja attacks. <laughs> <laughs> Barely kicks out. Not yet. Kicks to the face. Why was this the first match? Why can't the first match just be normal? Why is that gonna be bullshit? Big form. Thunderous club comes down. Very effective. Seventy-seven. A hundred. Oh, sorry, at least it's a 76. She re enters the ring now. Escape just in time. Face Buster. Is it enough? She breaks the count quick. She likely knew that wasn't enough. She's just keeping the pressure up. So that me. No. No. Absolutely. No. This is Buster. I think this is the first time for Lacey Evans on camera. Wind up. Uh, oh, yeah. oh, yeah, I did Lacey Evans versus Liv at one point, I'm sure. I think Liv did. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me! Just crashing down with high impact! Both wrists captured. That was nasty. Look at my shots. He has full health, no damage. Let's <laughs> see. <laughs> this is supposed to be the first time. The last time I was stopping the opponent. Yeah, that was the dream match. That was her dream match. That was her delusional dream match. Uh, in a world without. <laughs> what was that? Oh! Are you kidding me? Incredible. <laughs> Great awareness actually proves to be too quick. Look out! Actually, it. Let's make sure. Outside it's like of the ring now. Like What's the plan here? Oh, that hurt right in the kidney. Golly. Oh, man. They do not care who. Oh, they, oh my God. They destroyed. Yeah, Byron, you are dangerously close to being collateral damage in this one. Is it enough? The cover. Two counts. Yeah, we couldn't see what was going on. They are fighting. that without corners. the bell ringing. The guy that looks like, um, in a chair. Cobra clutches in. Cobra clutches in. And that's the ring announcer to his left. Mike Rome. And we might be about to go from commentators to participants in this one, fellas. That's a neat detail. Right there. Yep. A little peacocking from Lacey Evans, but not sure how that helps her win the... Hoisting a rob! No, that's the. Uh, what's it called? Love the mayor, Shotzi won. Here is your winner, Shotzi! No other way to put it, guys. That was kind of a butt kicking. That's oh, they gave her a mohawk. <laughs> they gave her like a mohawk. Even a sweat. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, which is perfect still. That first match sucked. I'm deleting that from the footage. That is not staying. Mellow is 
money. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Boston, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 210 pounds, the NXT Champion, Carmelo. This is going to be a problem. You'll see why. You're going to have a problem with knowing who to cheer for in this one. Oh no, who to cheer for? <laughs> Gentlemen, it's time to keep your eyes on the sky. And his opponent, from Dayton, Ohio. Dude, my, I hope this is going to happen when I watch the way I book this. I just thought it would be a banger. I'm going to ask. Before joining WWE, he even won the Dusty Classic and NXT Tag Team Championships early in his WWE career. But now has grown as a single competitor, too. Winning the NXT North American This is not title, guys. It's not Heat Wave yet. Let's go, West. They're cheering Wesley, too. They want West. Ten minutes to win. By any means necessary. I think they might be right. Carmelo Hayes came into WWE as a pure raw talent, and now that he's put some time in, you can see him getting better literally every week. The future is a long way off, but whatever it is, Carmelo's got it. But where's this guy too? He's the cardiac kid. Byron, shut up. Ready to face off against him is the high flying Wesley. It often seems like he is more home in the sky than on the mat, Corey. I mean, he did spend time in the Air Force before landing at WWE Saxon. I don't know if anything in this world can keep Wesley grounded. All right, keep in mind, guys, we are three for three still. Mat slam with some attitude. Carmelo Hayes, known for his high flying, flashy style. Obviously, that style can be very high risk. Will this be a free win because we like both of them, or do you want to just say, let's lose this we lose? Corey, you talked about this before. Could that style actually be a detriment? Let's lose as we lose. Like you said, Cole, it has all, right. all the potential to be crashing. So Carmelo needs to Hayes is as gifted a superstar as they come, and he knows what he's doing. He knows the risk, and he knows he's more often in store for a big reward. Why is West doing nothing? Go oh, right to the kidneys. Is West good. And Hayes is in command. Seeing some high risk, high reward <laughs> offense from Hayes already. Right now, Mello can't miss. Incredible drop. Mello reminding his opponent that he don't miss. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful. Submission. This one win the match, but it's doing a lot. Trying to find a way out. And he's out and delivers a knee. Carmelo, I believe, has moved to you. And I think that Wesley is come back. Climbs back inside. What the fuck's going on? He went right into that turnbuckle. West gets the better there. West is pushing back now. West showing how hard it is to fully shut him down. Whoa! This match I looked similar to what he did on uh, the next team this week. Okay. Alright, he's got a signature almost. West he's about to hit it. Tremendous athleticism connects with an elbow. And look at this! 
Wesley looks like he's rocket powered after that move. Just incredible. Mm -hmm. Close as it could get without it all being over for him. What's the what? How many times we thought this match was coming to an end? I can't count anymore. And Wes's counter. He countered it. Well played, punch ugly, but effective response. Oh, Showcasing his strike. West continues on the assault, <laughs> keeping things at his pace. <laughs> Lips move! Taken down. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Oh, what's that hit? Kicks out. He's just no. his life. Obviously, still has some fight left. I expect this Desperate to be. Desperate attempt here to get back on his face. It's two all stars. And now gets tossed into the ring. Carmelo putting it all on the line. Superstar to watch in the weeks to come. Yeah. That was a spectacular performance. Yeah. I guess we win either way. But I wanted Wes. Does he deserve a rematch or do we move on? What time is it? It's, uh, 6 6.30. We're way ahead of schedule. We could afford the rematch this, I guess. Mm -hmm. Four and it's only six thirty. And there's no tag matches this week. So there's nothing there's no matches that will eat up time. Or do you just want to have no perfect car you just have to take the one loss? You know what? We had one perfect card this year. I'm satisfied with having one loss. Right. If it's just one loss, I can deal with it. Okay. Let's move on. It's still a good match. Yeah. Wait, is there a time limit on this? No. Okay. Extreme Rules match is the next one. Oh, shit. For this person, yes, so you're not even gonna know who it is. Come on, Tiffany, beat this person. 
This is the first time you're ever gonna see this person. Wendy oh, Chu. ready to get in there and put someone's lights out. Well, at least we know Wendy Chu's gonna sleep good, no matter the outcome of the match. These matches are gonna be DJs. From Chinatown, New York, <laughs> Wendy Chu. Yeah, that's a car Chu. with a pillow. Uh, <laughs> Wendy Chu, a woman who marches to the beat of her very slow, very quiet drum. She like lethargic. It's <laughs> <laughs> waking up everyone to her potential. I disagree. Let's say there's a 50-50 chance she sleepwalks through this one. <laughs> no, she, that's just her gimmick. Oh. And she wears ice cream PJs. Uh oh. There's no telling what a competitor is capable of. Tiffany beat this woman's ass. Watch your theory. She's a 76. Tiffany's an 80 something. This is what she wore to the house show lad this weekend, so she's wearing the correct gear today. She wore all gold. Because she used gold. No, she wore all gold. This is Tiffany I'm talking about. Not Wendy. Coming back in the ring. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> wow, Tiffany's taking control fast. Come on, two, three, four, five. Six. Wendy is unable to stop any attack. Tiffany is unloading attacks here. Come on, Buff Barbie. Nice Japanese on drag. What a move. That's Tiffany's new nickname, the Buff Barbie. Buff Barbie. No counter. She takes this one to the floor. <laughs> she She's got a chair. I forgot it was Extreme Rules. It was designed for it. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Barbie's new takedown move. <laughs> the new Becky Barbie. With all the destruction, with all the carnage, Byron, is there a key to victory in something like this? There cannot be any hesitation to do what you gotta do. You have to be aggressive and stay on the attack. And in a ref, she's gonna get slow counted, Wendy. Oh, no. Do what you have to do. This takes strength, speed, and innovation. And don't forget about a merciless speed strike. And well timed maneuver there. Buff Barbie, rolling out of the wing. This is what you call high risk. Buff Barbie, you like Buff Barbie. Showing absolutely no. We're not checking Wendy, are you? No, I'm saying. Here's what I'm saying. I'm saying do not lose to this. If your name is Buff Barbie. Yes. Do not lose to Ice Cream Lady. Pajama Lady. Take control. Oh, yes, yes, Tiffany. Yes. And no. Uh -oh. <laughs> Counter. And she gets herself out of a precarious position. In the corner. 
you can get past the goal. Time for a PME, the prettiest moon song. Will Tiffany put the way here? Why? She kicked out. Are we sure that wasn't three? just about She does have a signature move though. Shoulder tackle there. Here comes that rolling fireman's carry. Oh. Nice rolling fireman's carry. With no count outs, there's nothing keeping her inside the ring. A sledgehammer. No, Don't use a sledgehammer. Think of the children. Oh, the sledgehammer connects. And she's going for it. <laughs> Oh, Jesus, you threw a hizzy fit. She is so fucking done. Steer clear of that. Single leg drop kick. Shoulders down. Don't win like this. Oh, just got my shoulder up. Everyone thought that was three. Fire buff Barbie doll Better today. Later. Yeah. <laughs> Tiffany wins and we, or, we are now four, four, five. Or right now when you get the days with which girl set. <laughs> yeah, when she was baby face. Yes. <laughs> Only if you pre-order. <laughs> We're now four for five. We're still at 90%. This match is a five minute match. You must win in five minutes. I forgot to edit the time. This will be a normal match, no time limit. Yeah. Tonight has just become almighty. And per normal, Lashley is ready for a fight. <laughs> the following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Colorado Springs. We're going to the title of match, it's really normal. Bobby Lashley! Okay, no Bobby. The Almighty is always on his grind and steps up to any challenge presented. An incredible resume of championship accolades. Bobby Lashley has held the United States Championship Intercontinental. Tonight just became phenomenal. A terrific striker, a master purveyor of high flying, innovative offense. AJ Styles has competed at this level for decades. Such a special capacity, accompanied by the kid, the Yen, representing. The OC from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds. The phenomenal AJ Styles. AJ Styles is an athlete who may be the best at 
I want AJ Styles. All right, I want AJ. Who do you want in this matchup? AJ or Bobby? Anyone else you would cheer for Bobby? Yeah. Unbelievable at times. This match was supposed to be a five minute time limit, but the match is not five minutes anyway, so I guess it doesn't matter. to being the best that he can be day in and day out is definitely worth taking pride in. In my opinion, all Bobby Lashley has to do to get this match won is keep the attacks oh, coming. Like, no, he just has to know, use no. those powerful blows of his to grind down the opposition until they have nothing left. That does sound like a good use for all of Lashley's otherworldly strengths in this match. The break buster. This fight is going down right in front of our faces. More up close and personal than I'd like to be. Ow! And he throws the opposition back into the ring. I heard the counter got silent. Placed in the corner. Got them right in the corner. Lashley's losing any kind of advantage here. You can't right, deny the precision agrees. we're seeing from Just AJ. Wait till later on live. Cause I'm hanging out with you. Styles. Lashley oh. a step ahead. Oh shit! What about me? I saw attack. that for a second, but I. Yeah, AJ bots uh, spinning. Move. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Guys, don't get offended. It's not. It's, it's nothing offensive about it. That was nasty. And it looks like they might have thrown Lashley off his game. Everything I mean, like things phenomenally done. Yo, AJ, you really popular. Very nice. Very nice. Oh no, this is how I stop fucking AJ Styles. Yes, yes. No, no, no. He doesn't. He doesn't have problems with gay people. He doesn't. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm joking around because yes, I'm he's just, he's he's just, just surprised. <laughs> that was a cool counter, but he missed his punch. Yes. <laughs> he's also like very. Oh, he's doing his finisher move. The Styles Clash. Can he finish the job? No, he's, he's popped. But that's a good thing because he moved out of bars. Yes. <laughs> And just what else can AJ do right now? He got all of it, and it wasn't enough. Suplex! Taking this match off the mat now. Lift off! You gotta love the look that so AJ is very religious. <laughs> He's like a outside, redneck but this one has Christian to end in the ring. Good news, AJ has resiliency? Uh, yes he does. So he's got this in bad. Unfortunately, Bobby Lashley is going to become Jobby Lashley. Just from this week, because we love AJ. Yes, he's going to be Jobby Bobby. <laughs> Grabbing a hold of the arm. All the way down. Things are looking dire for Lashley. Yeah, this is a dire situation right now. Is he gonna hit our Styles Clash? AJ no, he's going for the phenomenal forearm! Being taken away. He might do it. Oh! He dodged it! Submission move! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> AJ, you're not doing good this bad man. He can do the Styles Clash though! Oh, oh it's a counter. Bobby's turn around. Incredible. And I'm going to chuck you over here. 
I think he got confused. No timing. No break. No break. Wi-Fi to record. <laughs> a winner is you. Wi-Fi lost. Wi-Fi lost. Oh no. Okay, this oh. match is gonna be a squash match. Last woman standing though. That's a 66 overall. He is the lowest rated superstar. <laughs> yeah. So he's saying a 78 overall in Blue Zelina. Outfit she had, yeah. There, that was uh, what I was going for the first time. I had the wrong one. LWR, the choice to see. I fixed it. Has brought her great success. What is wrong with Queen Zelina's attitude, Saxton? You sound like a real peasant. Give me about four hours, and I'll tell Let's go, Zelina. Who are you going with? Zelina or B Fab? <laughs> because B Fab sucks. <laughs> this is our filler match, guys. Everyone has to have a filler match. This is last one standing, though, so they need a 10 count. Certain is that this match will have some ups and downs, some ebb and flow. The superstar that's looking good early could struggle late, and vice versa. We'll have no idea who the winner is until that ref. It says other people on the bra, I just realized. Hooked up. <laughs> Jelena is just doing whatever she wants. Unrelenting attacks from Is Lashley standing for no DQ match? It is. Yeah. You've got a share. Is what's needed right about now. What the fuck is a ring gear? It looks just weird. It's like fuzzy and shit. 
Look at all this beef ass rigor. <laughs> Lucas, you got your job to be fab. To be fab playable. <laughs> yes, it would be. Don't job to be fab playable. <laughs> you can sense what the intent is. Last week it's row. Took a gamble once, took a gamble again, and hit the jackpot twice. Salinas hopes are waiting. Yeah. Salinas yeah. can't allow this burst to hinder her. Yeah. And now she retreats. And quickly she has to take this moment to pull herself together. Do not lose to a 66 of love, for the love of God. What, the upper stamina? How is she 66? Sent into the corner. Look at this, going right after I thought she was going to do a super move or something. She just did that. Her karate. Zelina <laughs> Vega demanding a queen's reception. And oh, she's getting up. She's getting up. She's getting it. Hooked up. And DDT. All right, Resiliency is ready. Yeah, guys, I have to give her a payback. She had no paybacks. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Vega. For a lot of WWE Zero fans, yeah. SmackDown has traditionally been the quiet yeah. wrestling show. <laughs> then you taught me that I could edit the payback, so I yeah, her payback. Yeah, you just edit the payback. You can edit the payback, but you can replace it. That's why I gave her resiliency and comeback. It made sense for Zelina. The last time she gave up a seven. I'm just like, you're gonna have to do more than that. <laughs> this is why we don't do these that often. <laughs> that was a four. This match is wearing her down. <laughs> They're both just doing anything that they can to ensure victory and be the last one standing. By stupid shit. Oh man, the referee just counted to seven. And it looks like they still got something get left in the tank. Hooked up. Two more, please. Two more. Thank you. Oh? Hit the code red, hit it. Yep. Code red. Go. That's gotta be it. Well, that's so bad for Zelina. Zelina Vega demanding a Queen's reception, and she is. She looks dead. It. Oh, <laughs> it's so old. Hero has been hit. Completely unbothered, Zelina Vega. Nothing but disrespect for her opponent. She's up. Now you're up at nine. <laughs> She's still in this fight. And that was an effective attack, guys. Zelina is just doing whatever she wants. Unrelated. 
unrelenting attacks from Zelina. Remember <laughs> doing the last words <laughs> ever again. Zelina big up demanding a Queen's reception, and she is getting it. And, and that's an eight, stop. okay. This is either Chris. Does he give me flashbacks to the time? We did a flash with the stage after someone else did. See forever. Not what you want to see by any means. God, this is the second last match. Oh my God, they got this was the main event match. Referee's count has reached seven here. Getting dangerously close to the inevitable. Uh, just stay down. I left the under the eight. To the pattern. She heads out of the ring. Nice. Interesting strategy. Oh, yeah. She has a really good Don't win like this. I gave you 10 beats of the pattern, and that's how and I won. Somehow, someway, she breaks Five. the count. Just a tremendous amount of heart on display in this matchup. Oh, goodness. What a moonsault. Completely unbothered, Zelina Vega. Nothing but disrespect for her opponent. This is likely going to have adverse effects yeah, on her. She's only four. aggravating her competition at this point. Stay down. She's down face first. Beats the 10 count. Going to push on through the match. Springboard attack. She's trying so desperately. She's going to hear that code red. He's asking me it. We got counter. That's just this is not the time to be diverting attention away from the match. was left in the standing and Dean going lost in two seconds or something. <laughs> At this point, this is incredibly ill advised. You're in the middle of the match. Oh, you bashed it as an old bash and Gigi still lost. And she's up. She's going to keep fighting. So if this like just takes forever, do we just make this a bowl match? Cut out the count here, maybe with a little something extra in mind. Zelina saw it coming. It looks like she's got a few more ideas before we call it a day on this one. This has been a colossal battle to this point. No superstar is showing signs of backing down. She got a chair. She, what, she, she said, never mind. <laughs> she got a second chair. I got another one. I'm holding chairs. And stopping the referee's <laughs> count? That was silly. <laughs> She's tapping, she's tapping, but it doesn't matter at all in this situation. Chair in hand, she what is she doing? Absolute <laughs> damage. Four. Four. She's gonna win by a, a submission. Yep. That's a Count still climbing. We're up to seven now. Not over yet. No, she got up at nine. <laughs> and she dives that one nicely. Get to the midsection. She has a sunset power bomb as a signature. What's her finisher? It's coming. And no count outs means she has the whole outside to play with. She's up. She's going to keep fighting. 
taking this to the floor. What a hurricane. She'll take things into the ring. I regret this. Completely unbothered, Zelina Vega. Nothing but disrespect for her opponent. This is likely going to have adverse effects on the second match after the her competition at this point. Oh, shit. All right, back to it. Returning to the ring. Big four. Between the eyes, move. Forget what it's called. That. Eat the feet. That's what she's got. Eat the feet. She's got the whole WWE universe no, rallying no, behind her. And seven. It's getting close. And somehow, some way, she breaks the count. Just a tremendous amount of heart on display in this match. Brutal form. And Zelina looking worse for wear as this match continues. Zelina's really getting put to the test here. Has been going on for like. 15 minutes. <laughs> We're past an Iron Woman match. Oh, yeah, she's saying, let's go, bring it. Six. Why is she still boasting around? She's in a fight for goodness sake. Oh, man. Ouch. And Zelina looking worse for wear as this match continues. Zelina's really getting put to the test here. Man, there is no quit. Big knee to the midsection. And it looks like she wants to take this match outside. All right, she's back in, ready to she go. She went into the ring to get a weapon and decided, nah, I don't want a weapon. She's pumping herself up, reaching out for that burst of energy. That's seven. We may be getting to the end. She rises to stop the count. She's not finished. Not just yet. Kick right to the face. She made some knockout match. Oh, look at this or wicked striking match. ability. Buffet strikes. Zelina's hopes are waning, but Zelina can't allow this burst to hinder her. And she's using this moment to summon her strength. At this point, this is incredibly ill-advised. You're in the middle of a match. Tag it to the floor. What's she going to do? Suicide oh. dive. Shit. Into the ring again. And she is. Is she gonna off a suicide dive? Count gets no. to seven. This is close. And back in the ring we go. Up across the shoulders. And just like that, it's all over. I'm pissed. It's over. He's had wins. She's firing up, no doubt about it. Six. Can you use resiliency to pop back up? Getting close to 10 here. Nice. Now you got to dig deep. Nine. That's Nine. it. Calling it by knockout. She got up at 9.9. .9. And they counted it as 10. The superstar. Love seeing her get the win. Better than now. No, I meant his exit. It should be a normal match. Wins in WWE rarely come easy. 
thought I was quiet or not that. I'm just like hashtag. How are we doing on time? Can we even afford to redo that? Uh, it's seven fifteen. Uh, we have a tag match in the main event. I forgot. Uh. Extreme rules tag. This time, hold for it. Let me try. Now? Why is it so slow? He's actually just way faster in real life. Because, because it first does the best thing. I guess I'll do the intro. Oh, because this version of the song doesn't have the... Yes. It doesn't have the intro. The sound of the dream who is set to become every competitor... We're a little time with the little here now. I timed this one right. They can't lose to the Judgment Day. It's Seth and Cody teaming up. Superman teaming up with Batman. They can't lose. And notice how I had Becky start the show and Seth end the show. I didn't do I did that by accident, by the way, when I booked this, I, it's funny, it's a coincidence. Yeah, I made like a poster, like I did like this. It's like somewhere in the ass. This is a tag match, we gotta get this going. Yeah, we gotta get this going. Even though it's chaos, because it's extreme rules tag, so no tagging. Oh, this is extreme rules tag. I think that's the opponent's team is of course filled with Cody Rhodes and so Cody Rhodes. There's so many Cody Rhodes. The only There's so much Cody Rhodes is to earn that pin or submission in the ring. It is his game. 
<laughs> the first match was so great, and then this last match is just crazy. I was gonna break this kid's neck. At least the trigger matches are quick, right? I mean, there's no tagging, it's not boring, it's yeah. chaos. The problem is, it's chaos, and anything can fucking happen. Oh, that's the only way. That's why I like doing this. It's faster. I can't do these stupid tag matches anymore. Tag! <laughs> Two minutes later. Tag! Tag! Well, all right, we're winning. Tag! I don't think it should be a factor. I don't think it should be a factor. I'm going to be out of the contender. Fish AI. Fucking fish AI. Are you winning? Um. Are they taking some of the image set? I think I fucked it up and off screen. Stops the count before it too. He's nowhere near ready to stop fighting yet. He climbs into the ring. with the lid Morgan Dominic. Shade in hand, bad intentions in the <laughs> He can end it here. And there's the kick again. He clearly has no chance. We never do a lid move again, down. Dom. You are unbooked forever. You do not get the disrespect <laughs> like that. It's hard enough to do a Only Rio can, can do that. That's a good one. Everybody, he's got that sledgehammer. I don't know why he's wasting time. <laughs> <laughs> I respect him willing to do that. Come on, Rob, get some control. Shut up, my son. He skirts away, living to fight it. Look at her something, anything under the ring. He's heading back to the ring. He looks for nothing. He's not <laughs> Oh, Donald screwed up. He wouldn't have made it. 
the first one it was kind of boring there wasn't much happening <laughs> first but the second one's better <laughs> holy shit that was a great match all right time for our dark match our post show dark match which we have plenty of time for all right peace out guys that was a great free preview i'd say only two losses that's not bad